All right, so in this video, we're going to simplify this expression. In other words, we're going to combine like terms. So I'll show it in two ways. The first way is to realize um, that each term that we're combining is, is separated by an addition sign. So these are the terms we're trying to combine. The second thing to realize is that we need to combine the constants, or just the numbers, right? 3, 3, and 3 together first, right? Or second, I should say. What I meant to say was we can add these three constants to each other and not to these other terms with the variables, right? We have one group of 2x, another group of 2x's, and then another group of 2x's. So we can add those variable terms together. I'm going to put a plus between all of this to signify that if we had a value of x, we would be adding, right? So now we count. We have two groups of x, two more groups of x, and another two groups of x. Altogether, that's six groups of x. And then we have three, six, nine groups of one, or just nine. And that's our final answer. Another way to think about this, though, is just to write out, another way I like to write this out, is that each 2x really means x plus x. It means you have two x's. That helps me see the total number of x's is 6. Another thing to think about and remember is, um, I'll write this in red. This is an error, an error that people commonly make. If they see something like 2x plus 3, they'll say, oh, that's something like 5x's, something like that. Uh, but this just does not work. We can't combine 3 and 2x unless x is 1. This won't work. What do I mean? Well, if x was 1, let's see what happens. That would be 2 times 1 plus 3. And if x is 1, 5x is 5 times 1, or just 5. It works, right? 2 plus 3 is 5. So that works when x is 1. But in general, it does not work. So for example, if x is 2, we have 2 times 2, which is 4, plus 3. That does not equal 5 times 2, which is 10. Right? So if we plug in 2 for x and we try to add these directly to say it's the same thing as 5x, it just doesn't balance. So we can't combine terms with variables and constants unless we know the value of x. All right, thanks.